Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Boxing Reviews and How To, and today we'll be taking a look at how to fix problems when Office doesn't work. Basically, at the moment, my Outlook isn't working, so let's click on Outlook, and first of all, it's trying to do an update. It'll say, please wait a moment. I'll possibly fast forward through this, but eventually it'll come up with an error message, which you'll see next. So there we go, there is the uh, eventual outcome, so Outlook.exe application error, and we've got the end code there. So what I would suggest now, as part of the diagnostic routine, best thing you can do is actually snip the screen, or just basically write down the error message, so Outlook.exe, and also this section here, so we can always investigate it a little bit later. But let's uh, have a look at other things we can do to try and fix it. Now something else I did try, which uh, you can try yourselves, is to right click on Outlook, and then right click on Outlook again here, and then choose Run as Administrator. Sometimes that will help because it's maybe a program which is trying to update and it can't do because it doesn't have admin rights, that kind of stuff. You can certainly try that. I have actually tried that already, and unfortunately for me in this instance, it actually failed, so we won't go through that again. Next thing to do is to go into your settings and go into Apps and Features, which you can find in your control panel. And what we want to do is scroll down until we find Office 365 or Microsoft 365 as it's now known. And click on the hamburger menu on the side here. And you have the option to modify. You'll get user account control come up with Microsoft click to run. So just click on yes. And it says there, how would you like to repair your Office program? So you can do a quick repair if you want to. I find generally the online repair is the one that works best. So choose online repair. Click on repair. It says, are you ready to start? Blah, blah, blah. It tells you it may cost money if you're on a meter connection, all that kind of stuff. Yep, we're happy with that, so click on repair. So this is going to take a little while. We'll uh, let this go through, do its own thing, and then we'll come back at the end and see if it's actually repaired it. Okay, so after a short while, you'll come up with this and the Microsoft flag, and it says you're all set, Office is installed now. So we can close this, and uh, fingers crossed. Boom, there we go. Office is now working again, so uh, let's just try that. We'll go into Word as well. Yep, that all seems to be fine. So we can close those down now. So there we go, there is how to fix problems with Office 365 programs opening, such as Outlook, EXE, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, etc, etc. Hopefully this video has been useful to you. If it has, don't forget to smash the like button. I should say as well, if you're still getting problems and you don't have a legitimate version of Office, firstly, shame on you. You should do. But if not, there will be links in the video description for premium CD keys. This video isn't sponsored by them, but I just thought I'd mention it. You can get a very, very inexpensive Windows and Office license keys from them. Uh, links will be in the video description. Anyway, I've been Mike. This is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.